，閃亮嘅管牀，探尋巴黎奧運背後嘅光芒。大家好，我係館長周慧琪，歡迎嚟到巴黎奧運博物館，一齊了解一下運動員備戰巴黎奧運嘅情況。大家好，我係館牀解説員鍾心宇。喺呢一個旅程上面，我哋會一齊收集建築住奧林匹克精神同力量嘅珍貴藏品，記錄低運動員嘅熱血拼搏同埋閃亮故事。心宇啊，今日館長要講嘅項目咧，就係香港人都好熟悉嘅單車啦。不过佢并唔系大家睇到普通嘅单车啊，实际嘅名叫做小轮车，系极限运动自由式小轮车嘅比赛用具。呢项运动喺二零二零年被正式列为奥运会嘅比赛项目。冇错啊，小轮车咧，顾名思义就系车辘嘅直径比我哋平时用嘅单车仲要细，系得五十厘米左右嘅啫。车辘细，车身亦都好迷你，更加适合车手嚟掌握嘅噃。如果要讲小轮车同平时嘅单车最大嘅区别，就系佢嘅车把手可以三百六十度旋转，方便车手跳跃、转圈，完成更加多嘅技术动作。Sort of became a hangout spot after school on the weekends. When I was about 16, I started to realise maybe I could do something with BMX. So I was starting to do, you know, learn some bigger tricks, some of the tricks that you know the current pros were doing、um, at, at competitions, and that sort of made me, you know, think, you know, I could take this pretty far. And、uh, yeah, I sort of zoned in and focused on BMX and, and trying to make it a profession. If I didn't think I could do it, I probably wouldn't be trying again. But my mind is still in the game. My level of riding has increased the last three years, and I'm still pushing my level. And it's super cool, and it's,、uh, I'm still really enjoying it. So、uh, yeah, I'm going into Paris knowing that I can do it again. Martin 已经攞到巴黎奥运会嘅入场券，时隔三年再度参赛。佢嘅目標就係衛冕冠軍，為佢熱愛嘅事業同埋佢最愛嘅家人。冇錯，畢竟對於年滿三十歲嘅馬丁嚟講，會更加珍惜佢參加奧運嘅機會。閃亮的館藏，我哋下次開館時間再見。